Okay. So, volume statement. Two forces act at an angle of 120 degrees. Full stop. The bigger force is of 40 Newton and the resultant is perpendicular to the smaller one. Full stop. Find the smaller force. So first of all, write down the given data. The angle between two forces, that is theta is equal to, it is 120 degree. 120 degree. 120 degree. Then, the bigger force, bigger force, bigger force, that is F1 is equal to F1 is equal to 40 Newton. 40 Newton. Then smaller force. Smaller force. Smaller force. That is F2 is equal to question mark. We need to calculate smaller force F2. First of all, draw the diagram. So this one it is smaller force. Bigger force F1. Bigger force F1 it is given. F1 is equal to 40 Newton. 40 Newton. Then smaller force it is. So this one it is F2. F okay. So the resultant is perpendicular. So we need to calculate resultant. Draw the resultant. First of all, draw the resultant it is angle between resultant and that is smaller force F2 it is 90 degree. Okay. This one it is resultant so this this angle it is 90 degree this angle it is 90 degree okay. this angle it is 90 degree and the angle between two forces the angle between f two forces f1 and f2 it is 120 degree 120 degree 120 degree so the angle between bigger force and resultant it is alpha. This angle it is alpha. So angle between angle between angle between bigger force bigger force and bigger force and resultant resultant is equal to it is alpha. Is equal to this alpha. Okay. The angle between angle between between bigger force bigger force that is in bracket F one F one and resultant and resultant resultant is equal to alpha is equal to alpha is equal to alpha is equal to alpha that is 120 minus 90 is equal to 30 degree. 30 degree. Okay. so we know that tan alpha is equal to 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 F2 sin theta, F2 sin theta divided by, divided by F1 plus F2 cos theta divided by F1 plus F2 cos theta, F2 cos theta. Okay. So theta is equal to it is 120 degree. Put all these values, tan 30 is equal to F2 f two sin theta it is one twenty degree divided by divided by divided by f one it is forty newton f one it is forty newton then cos one twenty it is minus point five minus point five that is f two f just solve by the relation tan 30 it is so tan 30 it is how much tan 30 0 0.577 0 0.577 is equal to is equal to 
f2 f2 sin 120 it is sin 120 it is 0.866 f2 divided by divided by divided by put t minus put t minus 0.5 f2 0.5 f2 okay so take point put t minus 0.5 right side okay it will be point five seven seven point five seven seven in bracket put t minus in bracket put t minus point five f2 bracket load is equal to point eight six six f f so let's solve this bracket first of all point five seven seven into forty it will be twenty three point zero eight then minus point five seven seven into point five it will be point two eight eight five f two f2 is equal to 0.866 f2 f okay so take f2 terms one side so 23.08 23.08 is equal to is equal to 0.866 plus 0.2885 okay so 1.1. 1545 f2 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 is equal to it will be a 2 is equal to 23.08 divided by 1.1545 it will be 19.991 it will be take 20 newton it will be get 20 so smaller proceeds smaller force is 20 newton smaller force is 20 newton okay smaller force is 20 newton